No star scream that goes there, and that goes there. <sighs> then why don't you move all the equipment, Shockwave? Decepticons, arguing like little children. Who are you? I am Ravager, Cybertronian bounty hunter. What do you want? Six Earth months ago, your leader Megatron was... Let's see, how can I put this? Immobilized? Will you just get to the point? I know where he is. Are you serious, Shockwave? Whoa, look at that view! I know, right? Bulk. Bulkhead. Bulk. Come on, get up your lousy bucket of bulk. <laughs> what do you want, you jerk? For you to get off your tailpipe. Can you two can it? Our primary engine fuel line just took a hit after that last asteroid field. If you want this thing to stay afloat, I recommend we'd go fix it. Alright, alright, don't get your scraplets in the box. I'll come back. Well, Mr. Ravager, where is he? Right behind you. Huh? I guess we never thought to look here. In that case, I say. Oh no. That can't be good. That's not good. Whoa! We really are that dumb, aren't we? Free him. I have to warn the other Autobots. Ooh! It must be one of the Autobots. Help me up, you dimwits. <laughs> Mad <laughs> Decepticons. Leave me in our bounty hunter. I am... I know who you are. Ravager, assistant to lockdown. I thank you for breaking me out. What's your price? I want to take Starscream's place as second in command of the Decepticons. Hmm. I'm... Tracking the Autobots, if that makes your decision any easier. Deal! No, Bulk, you're doing it wrong. Okay, then why don't you fix it? Sorry, I thought you knew how to fix a basic fuel line. That can't be good. Teletran 1, what just hit us? Megatron? I thought he was locked up in Garrus 9. So did I. Wait, <sighs> the scrap was that? That was our primary fuel line. Hello, Optimus. I thought you were locked up tight in Garrus 9. You see, I was. Until my fellow Decepticons finally discovered the base you poorly hit me in. Bumblebee didn't do too much good defending it either. Sending him to the scrapyard was... easy. You know, for a bot named Hot Rod, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense that you should be able to put out fires. For a bot named Inferno, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense either. Yeah, I guess I didn't think about that. Do you think about anything? Uh, Rodimus? Kind of in the middle of something, Bulk. Rodimus, you might want to turn around. Bulkhead, what did I just say? Just turn around? What? Oh. This is the moment I've been waiting for. No! Psychopath! I hurt my knee. Ah! Oh, I can't get a clear shot. Okay, you pile of scrap. This one's for smoke screen. Huh. Good job, Bulkhead. Thanks, Rodimus. We should probably handcuff these cons. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Optimus. <laughs> Do you think that axe will save you? Optimus, no! So you're just gonna leave me hanging? Okay. Alright, cool. You foolish Autobots won't get away with this! Yeah, 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 I've heard it a thousand times before. Optimus, this is Rodimus, do you read? Optimus, this is Rodimus, do you copy? Teletran 1, display Nexus cockpit. 
We should probably go down there and help them. For once I agree with you on something. Wait, wait, are you just leaving us here? Well, one thing's for certain, you're not getting paid. <laughs> Till all are one. What was that? The primary fuel line must have burst. Which probably ruptured the engine. Which means we're going down. 